Hey, what's up, guys? It's Ryan Chair here uh, with PC DJ. Uh, this is a video demonstration of how to set up DEX3 for extended display mode. Uh, and by that I mean uh, DEX3 has video mixing and karaoke capabilities uh, and allows you to send the mixed video output uh, full screen to a secondary display um, or the karaoke lyrics to a secondary display. So what that means is your audience will just be able to see the mixed video output full screen on the secondary display or the karaoke lyrics. Uh, it's a really simple setup. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do before you even launch DEX3 is make sure you're in extended display mode. Uh, it's very similar on a Mac. Uh, this video demonstration is going to be on a, a Windows PC, um, uh, Windows 8.1 uh, to be specific. Um, but it sets up almost exactly identical on a Mac. Uh, and I believe it is called extended display mode on a Mac as well. Uh, so the first thing you're going to do, and you got to make sure you do it before you launch the software. So we're going to right click on your desktop and proceed to screen resolution. Now when you have a secondary display connected, uh, you're going to see a 1 and a 2. The 2 is going to represent the secondary display. Uh, if you've done it right, you will see a 1 and a 2. Sometimes you'll see just one uh, display with a 1 and a 2 on it, and that's just because you're not in the pr proper mode yet. So this, by default, typically, now it already opened in an extended display mode because I already had that set up previously, but uh, typically it'll open up in this mode, which is duplicate these displays. And what that means is it's just going to mirror the image. You're going to see the exact same thing on your machine on the secondary display. So you don't want that, obviously. That would mean everybody would see decks, and you just want them to see the mixed video or karaoke lyrics output. So from the multiple displays drop-down menu, select extend these displays. You're going to hit apply, which will apply the change. Obviously, mine's grayed out because I already had that applied, but you're going to hit apply, and then you're going to hit OK. All right, and what you'll be presented with when you hit OK is a box that uh, after it changes the display mode it's going to ask you if you want to keep those settings you're going to hit yes or OK on there as well. So now that you're in extended display mode and obviously what you'll see over here you know is your mouse will drag off the right side of your screen. It also depends on how you configured it. Sometimes you can set up the two to the left of your screen by by default it's almost always to the right of your screen. So you can see my mouse going between my screens here my mouse pointer. So now that we've got that set up, we launch DEX3. So now that it's open, we'll just I'm going to put this into video mode. And what you can do before you even load a video is click this the middle screen. As soon as you click this middle screen, the the main output preview here in the middle of DEX3, you know, and it same applies for any skin you're using. It's the middle window. It'll launch the floating window here. Simply drag it off the right side of your screen. See what I'm doing here? I'm dragging it off the right side of the screen so it shows up on screen two. And then you can either double click the center of the screen to make it jump to full screen or simply click the full screen button. So there we go. So now we'll grab a video. In fact, I think most of these over here are videos. Throw it up in our deck. And there you have it. That's all there is to it. So you simply just uh, set up extended display mode before launching DEX3 and uh, drag that little floating window to screen two, make it full screen, and it will be set up. Now, if you always use the same screen configuration moving forward, meaning uh, next time you plan to open DEX3, you'll have the same screen two connected, it will always open up at full screen. So, meaning as soon as you launch DEX3, if you left the secondary display open in full screen mode, it's gonna automatically fill the screen again on launching DEX3 the next time. Now if you plan to not use the secondary display the next time you launch DEX3 or a different uh, screen configuration, uh, the best thing to do would be to close screen 2 and, by, and, and it's easy to do, just take your mouse, drag it over here, just click once so the focus is kind of on screen 2, just click it basically 
and then hit the escape key on your keyboard. As soon as you hit escape, it'll close the big window. You can bring this back to your main display and just exit out. And that's it. And next time you launch Dex3, it'll open up closed uh, and you can launch it if you want to or not. You know, depending on if you're going to be video mixing or doing karaoke or just mixing audio. Hope that helps. Uh, keep checking the YouTube channel. If you got any questions, feel free to comment in the comments section below.